Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Conker's Bad Fur Day. When I last left you, we had just put an anvil in the bucket at the top of the map and our, on our right side in there, and we did a lot of stuff. We killed a haystack, and no, oh, that was the episode before. We didn't drown. That was good, and we got a lot of money. Got, got a lot of money, too. And we came, and that was the end of that area. Okay, good summary. And in this episode, we are going to continue on to the next area because we're done with the other one. So, where I last left you, I had run out of food. Now I have more food. As a matter of fact, I have four sausage biscuits, a peanut butter sandwich, a peanut butter spoon, a granola bar, and a soda. So that's a new record. Let's go. I mean, come on, even Conker's drinking a juice box there. <laughs> Ooh, okay. So, cool beans. Let's go into the house first. Uh oh. Darkness. Then redness, then rightness. Rightness? Rightness. Granola bar time. You know, it's cutscene. Found what? What? Ooh! Broken leg? I don't like the look of that schematic. No way! A gap! How did that even happen? If it worked up until then, how did that happen to the table? What happens? We have the fulcrum here. The fulcrum. Here. What? The vet problem, not good. Milk yeah. falls off because of a gas. Yeah. That is what is the problem. Listen to his reaction. I think I see. <laughs> Everybody's so stupid. Ah, now Soda this time. Gets I was mulling over what the kittens again. I tried many things. I tried... Elephants, pot plants, many things. But the one thing. Elephants and, and potted plants, sure many things. Time, I was sure it was a rodent. Sure enough, it was. This one. Furious Squitchtalius. To use the proper vernacular. To the layman, the red squid. All the vermin, all the varmints we've met this far, all the rodents we've met this far are about as tall as us. Why don't any of them work? Squirrel. We're the only red squirrel in the game, but we've already met, like, all tons of rodents, right? I think so. So it's a simple malish. We need. How about those weasels in the background? How about another block of wood? You know, spill your milk. We don't get duct tape. Oh, the duct tape again. Avoid the duct tape. Get me one of these red squirrels. Well, that could be a bad thing yes. for us, considering we're a red squirrel. Plot device. Yay! Alright, here we are. With our gas mask. Don't need it anymore. I thought you guys were unfriendly. This really smells. Ah, well, if she were like. Stone beetles, we roll the poo oh. around. Knows what the fuck? <laughs> no, really. If you watch, you watch your poo. Um, no. Uh, uh, no. Get your f***ing ass in there. There's these f***ing cows. Get them in there. <laughs> get them to crap, and I'll make you a ball of poo. And you can do what the hell you like with it. Go on, on your break. You still here? <laughs> oh, Johnny. Okay. Well, that's annoying. So that's the next place we gotta go. Into the trap door. Oh. B. B. Oh, there we go. I was pressing Z. My bad. Okay. So, I guess we're going that way. So, yeah, this is probably the grossest area in the game, as you guys can probably already guess. Um, NCS definitely had a blast with this one, as you could probably guess. Mainly for the music. <laughs> I mean, come on. Oh my gosh, no. Grab onto the rope. Okay. It's hard to see where it is. Um, hey, I got it that time. Alright. 
Okay. So, not very good controls. Very difficult, as a matter of fact. So, we gotta go here, actually. Um, uh, okay, good. Very thin board, so you gotta be very careful when walking. Maybe not that careful. Come on, a little faster. A little faster, Concord. Alright. Okay, there's a gap here. Come on, there we go. It's kind of obvious that that's gonna hurt you if you touch it. Um, maybe we gotta go down slowly because we'll fall off the end if we go too far. Come on. I guess so. Yeah. Really? What? Lies. Okay, I'll be right back. By the way, guys, you may be able to hear money calling for us um, in the background of this. Uh, we actually cannot get to that yet. If you know, if you've seen NCS's playthrough, you know why. But um, later in the story, we'll be able to do something that uh, allows us to get to it. And uh, but we can't get to it just yet, so don't worry about it while we're down here for the first time. Okay, so we made it. Let me go nice and slowly. This time I'm going to jump in that direction. Well, if I can. All right, let's land on this wall. Come on, come on. Yes. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Ah. Okay, I made it. I'm alive. That's good. Ow, I got hit by it. Ah. Go away. Thank you. Hey, look at that. We made it. All right, now climb up. And for those of you who are wondering, this is really, really not that easy. This is like really hard platforming because the platforms are so small. All right, I'm um, going up. Climbing, climbing. No. Do we want that just yet? I really can't tell what we want. Ah. Okay, come on, come on. This is a really hard jump. Come on. Okay, well, I didn't make it, but at least I know what I'm doing. I think. Not really. No, I don't know what I'm doing at all. Okay. Man, the music. Oh. Oh no, that was too far. Okay. Hey, it's, I saved it. Unbelievable save. Oh, what now? What now? I totally got that. Well, crud. Oh my gosh, the angle is so poor. Oh my gosh. This angle is evil. It's evil. Got to go a bit down on the rope. Oh, yes! Yes! It's a miracle that I made that. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So, if you look right when you're up there, you can see there's a little cavern. You don't want to go to that just yet, and there isn't really any way you can get to it anyway. Actually, what you want to do is just uh, fall down and then go out through this door. So, where are we? Where are we? There's a giant bull. I don't see any poo here. Oh, hey, uh, excuse me. Hello. Yeah, you. Uh, <clears throat> <whoa. laughs> it's finally tight. Yeah. I'm looking for some Cutscene. poo. I know it's pretty but... Red. Red. I don't like red. I hate red. One more reason by being... Oh, for why... Oh, uh, 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 ah. Take it, he doesn't like red. What? I don't see anything red around. smart. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Maybe One more reason again. why being red is a disadvantage to us in this game. Freaking racist people. Okay, so we need to fill up this trough. In order to fill up this trough, we need to... Well, we need to fill it up with prune juice. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, in order to get to the prune juice, I can't remember the exact path, but it's somewhere around here on the other side uh, let me go around in a circle once
Oh, it's back here. Yeah, this is it. Okay. So, in order to get up there, we just got to avoid the balls of you-know-what that are flying at us. I believe they come out two at a time. I've been wrong. I thought. Okay, never mind. So, they come out one at a time. Just wait for it to fly by and then get up there and run like a madman. Mad squirrel. Uh, uh, jump over it. Uh, they do come up two at a time. Ah, uh, wow. <laughs> what the heck? Where'd that even come from? <laughs> that's evil. Okay, well, that's not a good place to stop, I guess. Uh -huh. Let's jump up here. So they come up one at a time when they're when you're down here. And then when you get on there, they come down two at a time. And if you stay in one place too long, I think they come and hit you. They hit you off, that is. Come on, bro. Come on. I knew it. Oh, no. They just fall from that one spot. I just picked the unluckiest spot I possibly could have. Okay, don't hit me. Thank you. Thank you for not hitting me. Don't hit me either. Yes. 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 You have no idea how much trouble I had with that last time I played this game in the live and reloaded version. My friend and I spent hours trying to get up that. Okay, so you can see this arrow right here. In order to, and the clue there is that you just have to spin around in circles in the direction of the arrow. And if you do that, it opens this valve which allows prune juice to come out of the place. Now, there's one thing that prune juice is very, very famous for. And that's making now, things go to, to the bathroom. Drink that. It's gonna get the screaming squits. As Conquer just said in layman's terms. Oh, that looks distinctly like a target. And there we have a ball. Yes. I think I get it. Yeah, so that basically screams out what you have to do there. Um all you pretty much all you have to do is get the bull to hit the target. Really? That's all there is to it. Can I get on the building? I can! I can! Ow. Come on, I got hurt for that twice. Man, that's lame. That's lame. Okay, so this is actually going to take a while. It's a bit of a challenge. <laughs> there you go. We get a bit of Mexican troubadour music. Um, it's going to take a little bit of a while, so I'm going to end the episode here. It should be a little bit shorter than the last two. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Conquer's Bad Fur Day. In the next episode, I'm going to eat more of my luncheon here and drive bulls into targets. So thanks for watching and until next time, see you guys later. Now's not the time for beaver pornography. Now's the time for soda. <laughs>